Yeah, Goodness. that's that's it too. But whatever. Oh, I, uh, your watch yeah. thinks you're because you're uh, right punching the clown. Yeah, but I'm not left-handed. I have absolutely no strength. Oh, in my left hand. or you're right. Oh, we started. Is my turn? turn is it? I don't care. I'll do it. Oh, hi everybody! Oh. <laughs> hi everybody! <laughs> Welcome back to not another gun cast. As usual, or well, if you're new to this shit, this is not child friendly. This is entirely satire. We are professionals at things that is not podcasting, and we like to give you our opinions because we're kind of conceited dicks. We like to talk. We like to hear ourselves talk. I mean, you really do. Uh, yeah. Actually, I have today. Um. Um, also, I think we should add, we've done it before, but we always forget to add this in no way. Um, our opinions are legal advice. Legal, well, that we forget to add that sometimes too, but uh, do not reflect our employer's point of view in any means. Uh, it's just our own opinions. Yeah. Um, we're not sponsored by anybody in any way, shape or form. It's uh, the apocalypse. Shit balls. Anyway. Yeah, so that's that's oh. just something we need to add a little bit long more. Uh, yeah, well, you know, to be fucking honest, we need to write this shit down. Yeah, because <laughs> right. I'd rather read it off a damn cue card. We'll just hang it on that wall there. Right. Yeah. It just is. Oh, is that like breaking the fourth wall, like in movies? Oh, I don't know. Uh so go push all the buttons, the the like, subscribe, like, subscribes, do all that good stuff, you guys. The more you share it, the more people see it, and. Find us on Subscribe Star. Subscribe Star. That's so we can break at. even. Uh, subscribe Star. Uh, for you. Which one is doing that? It's on mine. I'm like, I'm not even getting any notifications. Odd. All right. Whatever. Hey, uh, we don't do smooth. Yeah. So, Subscribe Star, you guys. <laughs> it's uh... <laughs> It's got to be on that one. I'll figure it out. I feel like a cam girl. Like. Don't look like one. When they get the dings, and they're like, "Okay, now I'm gonna take." What does that mean? I don't. I don't watch that. Um, get over you, little mother. <laughs> the fucking mouse cursor won't go over. <laughs> anyway, subscribe star, not another gun cast. Uh, check us out. It's a good time. Uh, we are gonna be doing uh, but we'll have tier rewards here soon. We've got some stuff going on. Um, those of you that know us or that have been subscribe stars already you know what's going on so you guys know that we're uh, super busy right now i don't know if it's possible for us to be any busier <laughs> no. i mean we had like a two-hour break today we get a half hour break tomorrow i uh i literally like almost cried on the way home yesterday so i was just like so like overwhelmed with shit dude after fucking doing a remodel because and... you know me dude I like like i've got one thing to deal with and i got two other people telling me to deal with one other like you know what I mean? Yep. Like, you know what's going on. You're just losing your shit. Like, holy hell. Like, I literally almost sobbed like a little baby. I mean, it wouldn't be the first time, nor the last. No, but first you know time from, like, a, a stress panic attack. Maybe that'll be, like, a new subscription goal, <laughs> like a tear. I make Justin cry. <laughs> <laughs> I find a way to make him cry like a bitch. Yeah. Anyway, so um, once everything settles down in a few weeks a month uh we'll be amping that shit up a little bit more we've been doing better at like posting stuff and things yeah i mean there's a lot of <laughs> there's a lot of fuel to add to the fire there and we're loving every minute of yeah. it so it's great when you do get like five seconds or whatever to like as you're searching for a message that somebody sent you and you're like yeah you're supposed you, you to you find uh you find an awesome meme and super quick to post and stuff so that's easy for us to do right now um and then when we're sleeping we do the same thing for those of you uh subscribe star members that are in the slack we apologized a couple weeks ago i'm apologizing again that will amp up again once we and you guys know what's going on already so (laughs) we already got one that wants to upgrade for you crying (laughs) yes fair enough um (laughs) so yeah like uh so the subscribe star, not another gun cast. Uh, right now the tier is four ninety nine a month. That's uh, a uh, couple cups of coffee, a uh, can of chew. Do you ever just buy one can of chew though? I, I don't know. Yeah. 
I go to the store and they're <coughs> sitting there for me. I mean, I think that says something about your addiction. I don't give a fuck. I didn't say addiction. Oh. I know. So anyway, <laughs> what do you want to start talking about? I don't friend? know. You want to just talk shit about our day with uh, not the TP part. That's that's still funny. I don't fucking care. But no. So <clears throat> I'm really disappointed in our Facebook. Group. <laughs> We spent minutes coming up with that. We actually had a break where there was like no customers in there. And like, would you say so? I don't even know how it happened. Like you said something. It was, was me. Like, I was like, oh, oh, we can't give the cardboard away. Yeah. And I was like, oh, 80% TV kits, dude. And I'm like, and you're like we get, we're making a meme like right now. And like, none of you fuckers have liked it. <laughs> Not one. You guys shared like the shit out of the fucking. <laughs> stomping the shit down the drain. The stomping shit down the drain. Uh, the fucking uh, what was the other one that just blew up to like? Ah, uh, it was another dumbass. Twenty thousand fucking dizzy. No. Anyway, um, yeah, that was one we made. Like, share the shit out of that. Come on. Oh, you are so sad about that shit. I am. Eighty percent TP kits. That shit is funny. It's unregistered TP, bro. <laughs> It's unlicensed. It's unlicensed. It's less clean. <laughs> you got to do like, well, like ninety percent of the work in that one. But it's an eighty percent or dude, like twenty percent of ninety percent. Well, I don't. It's just. It's so stupid. It's funny. It's great. You guys suck. <laughs> Thanks, dear listener. We fuck still. You. We still the fuck out of people's memes. Like, no shame. Steal the fuck out of people's memes. I don't even give them credit for it. I just no. steal it. And I finally make one, and you guys are like, Meh. You are so upset about the dumbest shit right now. <laughs> and I love it. Me. Oh my God. Oh. Me. Justin took two minutes out of his day to create a fucking hilarious piece of you know comedy what? gold. You want some justification? Just go post it on Reddit. That shit will probably blow up. You'll get all of like seven likes. Disappointed disappointing uh, it's fucking embarrassing let's talk about oh wait i gotta pull this up real quick okay um so what was the first fucking thing we walked into today when we opened nicks yeah jesus christ so at 9 30 this morning it was at 800 800 and some odd yeah in the queue backed up for background checks by 10 o'clock, it was 1,000. It was an 18-hour wait by 11. 18-hour wait. Uh, when we left, excuse me, at 5 o'clock, it was 2,284 people in the queue in line. That is waiting Holy to get a background shit. check in the state of Colorado. We had one go through today, yeah. and he was first thing in he the was morning. right like, there at the door. Like, as yeah. as we and he was a bit of a panic buy. He came in for a little bit of ammo, he left came, with a lot of ammo, yeah, and a rifle. Yeah, yeah. Do you have an opinion on that, Dizzy? <laughs> yeah. Panic Don't guys. rile her up. Panic <laughs> guys are silly. Oh. Um. So yeah, panic buying is a thing with guns. Yeah. Like right now. Yeah, it's huge. So, you guys, if you can get it, <clears throat> you probably can't. But uh, ammo gone. Ammo. Find it now because you've got maybe two days to order it, and it's completely just gone. I'm telling wiped you, wiped out. Nine four uh, nine two twenty three seven six two twelve gauges going fast. Yeah, um, it, those were the main ones. I don't mean at. to be like the panicky dude or whatever, but I'm hopefully telling you've you, already got your stock. Telling you listeners now, it is it's gone. Emo is gone. Guns are flying off the shelves. Yeah, I mean, unreal rates right now. So don't like rush out and panic and go get in a car accident trying to get to your fucking gun store or whatever. Yeah, just watching the show and then go. No. Yeah, and then like rob them or whatever you got to do to get. Wow, in. <laughs> that's kidding. how we get arrested. I'm just kidding. Thanks. For um, that. But yeah, like it's it's serious, guys, and it's stupid. It's Fucking dumb, but it is what it is. Ammo's gone. Yeah. Yeah. It's really, really gone. 22's not gone. 
which is no. I mean, yeah, you still got the major caliber yep. nine millimeter, uh, two two three five five six. Oh, I wish we could talk about that other thing. That's yeah. too soon. It's uh, it is dissipated. Yeah. Everywhere. Kind of like my fucking stance that might be in. I'm not even <laughs> tell that goddamn story. <laughs> That's actually fucking hilarious. But yeah. So anyway, yeah, you guys just think about that, ponder it, however you may. Don't let me think about it for a minute. <laughs> No, uh, don't panic. Like I said, we're not inducing fear or anything like that. It's just ever, if you don't if you don't got it, go get it. I ever tell you I knew a dude that had his eyelids tattooed, and one said "don't," and the other said "panic." No, that's really fucking never understood that. No, because then you're like, don't panic, bro. Like you make me want to panic just by fucking tattooing <laughs> right. your eyelids with weird shit. <laughs> yeah. No. Uh, so where are we at here? Oh, yeah. Man, our brains are fucking fried, so if you don't want to bear with us, too fucking bad. Yeah, you know, that's, what oh. that's what makes America so great. I got a story I hid from you. What's up? Uh, so I got this on Thursday, and I was like, ooh, I should tell Justin. Nah. No. No. Uh, Colorado House Committee <laughs> to consider red flag <laughs> repeal legislation. Nice. Do you know that? I did not hear that. So... It's HB 1271, but they want to get rid of the ERPOs, like, as far as the indefinite shit, mm-hmm. and just make it a mandatory mandatory 72-hour hold, which you're still, oh, okay. I mean, I, I feel like you could fight that anyway. Right. Because when they do your intake, you can be like, no, I'm good, and fucking bounce. Right. But they'll. They, it sounds like they're still going to hold you. Huh. So I don't like that they're going to hold you no matter what. It should go to court first, but they're not taking your guns. Now that's legislation, obviously. Right. And in our state, it's not happening. Not fucking happening. Oh, and that came from the NRA. Ugh. Sorry, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Propaganda bullshit. There's your panic vine. Right. Ooh. What? Remember what made me so happy when I found that uh, BFR in thirty thirty today? Yeah. What do you think? Is that better than the forty five seventy? I mean, you get a little really. little lighter on your wrist by like a cut hair, if that. So much fun though. Thirty thirty. Mm-hmm. Forty five seventy. I think would be more fun. I mean, it's a bit more badass, right? Like that's the big boy one. Yeah. It's gonna be one of them nights. That's three in like twenty minutes, I'll bud. Give you that one. Well, I know you will. I'm right. Motherfucker. All right, let's go. Where, uh... Oh, so since most of y'all know I'm quite the nerd, why did I fucking load it? God damn it. Um, so the course revolvers have been barely coming into the, into the States through uh, Nighthawk Custom, but they just started importing the Nighthawk Custom Super Sport Red ULX and 3... 57. What the fuck happened in there? Did you die? I got the COVID-19. Oh, here. The cure's in there. Oh. <laughs> no, thanks. Anyway. i die. <laughs> oh, shit. Anyway. Yeah, fuck topics. <laughs> Where are we going? Go for it. No, no I was go. talking about the, the, the Kortha, God damn it. Super Sport Red ULX. God, that thing's gorgeous. I see that one. You didn't see the. You've never seen the Korth revolver. No. <clears throat> They're like, oh, I can't remember, like six grand. Oh, but, that's it. Yeah, the, the Korths are one of the few revolvers that you can actually suppress. Oh, that's right. You were telling me. Yeah. They're so, so fucking the cool. Forcing cone is so mm-hmm. tight. Now there were some older revolvers that you could suppress that were built that way, but not a lot. I still want. If anyone of our listeners is a fucking machinist. <laughs> Wants to thread a Heritage 22 for me? What if they're just a machine head? Whatever. If you can give me half by 28 threads, oh, I will. Yeah, but you won't even use your can on it. No, I You'll use my can. That's what you'll do. I'll have to get a new can. I mean, that's not a bad idea. I mean, it's the end of the world, so. Yeah, fucking animals are everywhere again. How many times? How many times have we seen elk in like the past week? Like every other day. Like more than I ever have 
in since the, I've lived here. Let's see. I've lived out here for almost eight years. No, seven. I've been I her, never see elk out here. I've been out here ten. Never see him. You see the you see the sign. You see the sign. You never see them. And every fucking day lately. Yeah, every damn day. Well, I'm gonna say every other because I'm a pessimist, I guess. And it's just it's fucking awesome. It is. So I can't wait for my tag. I might say I might I might actually put in this year. You might actually put out too. Mm, if it'll give me an elk, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. That took a dark turn. Not gonna talk about that. I will pour myself for an elk. Oh, I actually didn't read this one. Streamer discharges gun during live stream. Hilarity does not ensue. I read the rest of them. Fuck. Dude. Oh, busy. Clear your shit. Yeah, we like busy. If I'm like if I'm on my phone, it's answering emails, fucking phone calls, fucking Oh, he's drunk too. I'm gonna just read this. After drunkenly discharging a handgun during a live stream, Twitch streamer and esports player Carl whatever What's this has been banned game? from the streaming service. It doesn't say, but he's banned oh. and dismissed from the esports company Soar. That is no, see, that is fucking hilarious because he's drunk, he's stupid, and playing with a gun. Right. We get drunk and stupid and play with. Oh no! But we. Make sure our guns are safe before we're drunk and stupid. Mine's over there somewhere. Mine's over there. Unloaded. Cleared. Let's see how drunk you get and see if you forget it. Yeah, that happens sometimes. Oh, there's a video too? Damn it, I have to watch that later. (sighs) It's like, is it one of those that's like, my mom's going to kill me? Oh, I don't know. I didn't watch it. I told you that. I'm asking. Oh, really? Why are you looking at me when you're talking to somebody else? Because you're here and they're not... Fuck off, man. Not in the mood. I've been on you all day. Like, since you got up, I've been talking shit to you. Yeah. And I'm proud of me. So, if you guys have, like, a friend or best friend, and you work at a place, and you have a job opening... Don't do not, fucking hire him. Don't give it to the, your fucking friend or best friend. Especially when you have the same mentality about fucking everything. Yeah, just don't, because... They didn't get sick of them and want to shoot them in the face half the time. And... Well, you do say that a lot. <laughs> you don't fire me as often, but you say you're going to fucking shoot me a lot. <laughs> you said that in front of the boss. Yeah. Eh. And I never got a disagreement. Uh, let's go down to the bottom of the article. It's just like the... Okay, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to check it out right after now. the show. Um, I definitely want to see it. That is pretty good. It's probably been pulled by now. That was like a week old. Uh... Oh, man, I had something for this. Damn it, Archer. <laughs> Damn it, Archer. <laughs> uh, da, da, da. Yeah. So, Do you have any input this week, or are you just going to be... Dude, you know how my life has been the last two weeks. It's the same as mine. Do you have three bosses telling you what to do in three different directions constantly? I mean, I have... Kind of. <laughs> I, I, I really kind of do, if you think about it, but... Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Hello, Crystal. How's it? What? I don't know. She I just know. said hello, gentlemen. So I was okay. um, Two new gun bills are just the beginning, Colorado Democrats say. Yeah, I don't fucking care. Ooh. No, that's actually... Uh, it's not a bad thing, but it's just... I can't remember. I think I actually read that one. I think I replied to that one, actually. You did not. Oh, you don't reply to shit. That wasn't that one. I You're replied stuck to one. Up. I replied to one. <laughs> Fuck, man. I try. I try so hard. But Is try the right word? I'm only one man. I mean, that's... I mean, width-wise, maybe one and a half. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. I forgot we had uh, new listeners that we know personally. Jesse and Abby. Hi, guys. What's up? What's up, dogs? Thanks for subscribing, dogs. Spending money in the shop, dog. <laughs> oh, we're fucked. <coughs> oh, my God. There, Look at this. Advertisement, advertisement, advertisement. Fuck the Denver Post. I can't read it. Motherfucker pop-up. 
Can I get an ad blocker on my iPhone? That's my new, uh, it's going to be my new mixtape. Motherfucker pop up. What's your old mixtape? <laughs> you stupid fuck. <laughs> oh, you did reply to that one. That one that you said I didn't reply to? It is way down there after a different article. Uh, yeah. You don't know how to reply to an article. You're kind of special. Fuck off, dude. Seriously, I tried. You know, we did run into shit with that magazine restrictions today. Yeah, we did. Yeah, distributor-wise. Mm-hmm. That's shitty. Boy, we sold magazines uh, fast But today. it's a... Uh, I got an email back. It's something completely different. than. Oh, good. Man, we ran out of magazine. We ran out of P-Mags. Uh, ran out of 9mm. Fucking uh, uh, Almost ran out of 223. Very little two two three left. Slugs are gone. It's the apocalypse, bud. It's the fucking cock apocalypse. World. Do not sing that fucking song. <sighs> oh, I hate you. So I'm not gonna much. do it because I hate it so much. Um, yeah, <laughs> it's fucking crazy, dude. People are like, I mean, we could spend the whole show on that shit. People are panic buying. End of show. Oh. <laughs> Like, legit panic. So one of our really good customers that comes in, like, almost every week uh, yeah. came in yesterday and was telling me that they were in another shop. And he was like, dude, it was, like, legit hippies. Like, people that, like, you never see in a gun store. Dreads and shit. Stinking of patchouli. Like... Patchouli and B.O. Oh. And just everywhere in that store. And, like, they're buying guns now because of this shit. And it's... Hey, good for our industry. Yeah, it's I great mean, for us. I mean, it's supply and demand. We right. run out of shit. And problem is, I hate when prices skyrocket because right. we're out of shit. That's, I mean, we don't, you know, you know, no. somebody's going to start price gouging. And you saw soon. it today. We had to like bring out a box of the personal boss, shit, the boss's personal shit. And we did not price gouge at all. We mm-mm. kept it at co- almost cost. Gary. Hey, Gary. Um, I need to call you. We don't uh, We do not do that shit. Old, old friend. Very old friend. Oh, that's on your shit. Yeah. Your shit. Yeah, don't fucking... You stay out of my shit. You stick with your... So anyway, you know, like the gun store was fucking wild. I mean, wild today. Unreal, man. It was holy Well, hell. last weekend, too. Uh, last Sunday was as wild as today. Yeah. I'm wondering about tomorrow. Like, if... Holy shit. I mean, the first guy in the door was like, hey, the entire town is out of 12 gauge. What do you got? Yeah. We got a shelf, buddy. <laughs> yeah, not anymore. Fill her up. Nope. It's gone. Yeah. No, we, we did all right on 12 gauge. Um, but yeah, anything that's common, poof. Gone. It's like fairy dust. <laughs> Overnight. Overnight, yeah. Like we watched Friday it. was fine. We watched it disappear. Yeah. We watched those next checks just skyrocket. They they started yeah. getting high at the end of the day yesterday. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we had well, the number doesn't matter. We had a lot of forty four seventy threes going through. Background checks were going up. Ammo was going down at the, like the same time. Everybody that looked at something, we said, "Hey, we'll sell it to you. You ain't taking it home till tomorrow." You had eighteen hour wait time. Yeah, that's baffling. You think we'll get back up to like the multiple uh, oh, weeks? It's gonna carry over from today. It's going to get so bad. If we sell anything tomorrow, it's going to carry over. Yep. Man. Yeah. It's crazy right now. Yeah. I'm. We got to get off that topic because, I mean, I'm sick of hearing about it. We lived it. Why, Dizzy? California assault weapon man may be struck down. Really? Uh, Roden, why the fuck didn't you put that in our Slack channel, you son of a bitch? He's got his own podcast to worry about. Yeah, send it. Go listen to that, too. Send it. We dig it. I'm behind, but I'm kind of special. I think it's all right. I mean, it's Roden, so I mean, how fucking good can it be? Right. Love the guy, but he is Roden. <laughs> He's kind of a piece of shit. <laughs> oh, that guy didn't come in today. Those two rifles that I worked on. Eh, anyway, yeah. I worked on a bad idea of a fucking four-in change today, didn't I? For what? 
that forend that I changed today. Yeah. Jesus Christ. I can't even describe it to y'all. Sean was there. Sean. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I, it was. He's like, you want to put this forend on? <clears throat> nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I'm like, that's your cell, dude. I straight handed it, it to you. And nope. what was funny was like, I, I was like, I think I handed you the ID to like run a 4473 or a background. Yeah, and I took over the other You're people. like, oh, no, no, I'm busy over here. I'm like, okay, cool. Like, it wasn't that big of a deal. And then you're like, you want to do this for in? Nope. You started it. You finish it. What is it? It took me, what, like 30 oh, minutes was, to change a fucking was, handguard? I, I saw it and I knew. I was like, this oh, I knew. It's a bitch. I broke a AR wrench. <laughs> Good job, dude. I broke one of your wrenches. Yeah. I mean, I'll bring mine in to replace that one. I don't give a shit. Um, that's good stuff, man. Yeah. When a handguard's on that fucking tight that you break a wrench, dude, that barrel nut, I swear to you, must have been torqued to like 150. <laughs> dude. I, I pride on no. that. I saw it and I was like, nope, fuck you. Do you see me shaking when I was... <laughs> yeah, dude. All the way down. I'm like, oh, I'm so glad... Cause that would have been that like four weeks ago. That was me, dude. Like, right. The only dude in the shop. Yep. Like, oh fuck. Fifteen other people in the store. And I'm yeah. sitting here wrenching on a motherfucker. Yeah, and then your customers asking you if you need help, and you're just like, fuck off. I flat out told him. I said, I'm about to put channel locks on this and break every bit of it. <laughs> I told him I would. Oh. Uh, no, right, I, and I don't know what the fuck it was. It was just. It was bad. It was stupid. It was a quad rail on a not a D ring, but like a DPMS pattern. Yeah. Okay. It was awful. It. Yeah, it was bad. I, I had to use I, a strap wrench to break the handguard loose, and I had to use the strap wrench until it was ninety percent of the way off, I, like cranking. Uh, dude, I was so happy. Like I've done so many of those, and like, I know I was like, I'm just glad it's not me at this point. I mean, I I guess I am the fucking new guy. I do have to take her out, apparently. Yep. I told you. <sighs> fucking don't tell me nothing. But yeah, it, oh, it's. It's actually nice having somebody that can actually do work in the shop besides me. Because I saw him bringing that rifle. I'm like, fuck, he either wants to sell that piece of shit or he wants parts for it. And I'm I'm not dealing with it. And, you know, I mean, like, our knowledge level is not not that far off. Other than I don't know dick about Glocks. But I'm working on it. Sort of. I'm talking about working on it. That counts, right? That counts. Give you, give you props for that one. I mean, they're all the same. Who cares? A glack's a glack. <laughs> Size doesn't matter. Kind of doesn't a Glock. No, it doesn't. They're all just Glocks? Pretty much. Glockenspiels? Glockenspiel. Anyway. Man, we had fucking fun today, though. Yeah. Went by fast. Didn't eat lunch until like 3.30. That was good. I didn't even eat lunch. I had my uh, breakfast sandwich that I normally get at my gas station on the way into to work. You're such a fiend for that fucking gas station. They got the best breakfast sammies, dude. Eh, I don't know. It's variety. Because you could either get a toaster or the biscuit. <laughs> yeah, variety. Anyway, oh. Or red chili burritos at- Nine o'clock in the morning. We ordered something that you didn't even know existed today. Thirty-two oh, twenty. Oh, thirty-two twenty, man. That little old lady. So this lady had to have been like what eighty? <laughs> Fucking damn near. She was Dude. maybe four foot tall at this point. Comes in. I want a nine millimeter revolver. I was like, performance yes, center. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> it took so long to figure out she was talking about the LCR. Yeah. Thank God I saw that in our from our distributor. Uh, it was funny, man. She was. But then the- she was like. My husband needs uh, three boxes of thirty-two twenty for his rifle. Or you said it was a pistol. I, I I'm know. pretty sure she said revolver. Either way. And we're like, sure, we'll look it up. Why not? Sure shit, we found it. Yeah. 60 bucks a box for thirty-two twenty. And she ended up taking two. An absolutely, absolutely fucking awesome cartridge from the 1880s. <laughs> that's, you know, slower than shit. Useless S- past 100. Slower than a snail turd. Yeah, 1,200 feet per second, 325 foot pounds of energy. Yeah. Just total awesomeness. <laughs> Dog shit of a cartridge. We never shot my 32. I don't think we're ever going to shoot that thing. I think, it'll, eh, okay. I think it'll blow up in our hands. I think you just need to keep it as a cool little collector's piece. And 
maybe finish it up as uh I like that 32. Yeah. That's fucking cool. Yeah. I don't think you'll ever get the the, the extractor for it. That or the uh the timing right. Uh no, that's that's all on the extractor because the Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Yeah, the star. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so worth it. Oh, I'm texting. Why am I texting? Sorry. Oh, it's because it popped up over there. See, motherfucking, all these pops and motherfucker, motherfucker. Ain't that a motherfucker, motherfucker, motherfucker? You really don't need to try to make a mixtape, like at all, ever. I was, I was spitting Adam Calhoun, man. Like, he's faster yeah. than him. Man. Yeah, he's you, him. you're not him at all, man. <laughs> don't even try, bud. Who's not running out of ammo? That little old lady with her thirty-two twenty-two <laughs> boxes of it. <laughs> when the boogler, dude. when the boogler goes down, dude, she's gonna be like, "You knock on her door, right? You're gonna get a like just a slow, painful, <laughs> penetrating thirty-two twenty round stopping power, bud." No. <laughs> oh, we had somebody say that. Was that yesterday? Talking about stopping power of a forty-five. I, dude, I held in a laugh so fucking hard. Oh, I don't even know, man. We had so yeah, somebody was staring at 1911s. It Stop was, it, Bella. I you know what I always want to say, you know that shit's a myth, right? Like that's not a thing. Two world wars. That is a thing. <laughs> I need a I think I need a fucking Mauser broom handle. I'm a, a C96 Mauser? Yeah, but that'll shoot like a Luger. Yeah. It's no fun. No, I mean I just wanted to look at. Yeah, it's fun. I mean, that's all I do with my fucking AK is look at it. I haven't even tried that new trigger. Why? I don't know. Guess what we're doing tonight. Drinking responsibly and going to bed. Because we have to teach a fucking CCW class tomorrow. <laughs> Why did we do that? Like, right during all the shit we're doing, you scheduled a fucking CCW class. It was bad fucking judgment and timing. No, no, we don't need a fucking trombonist. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Is that from the rusty tromboner? Yes. Jesus. <laughs> I love how the pre-show shit is now the show shit. <laughs> On the shit show? On the shit show. Ain't that a motherfucker, motherfucker, motherfucker? Yeah, you need to stop that. <laughs> I'll burn out your camera again. Better fucking not. He got a new flashlight. Now he's for his birthday. And now he's all fucking proud of it. Wait, I got it for my birthday? No, you bought me a stock for my birthday, though. Yes, we I had did. to change the AK stock. Yeah, you want to grab it? Oh. What? I don't even remember what it's called. You have to do that. Zukov. Oh, that's right. That is what I got. Yeah. So um, I gave him a stock, and a screw fell out of the tang. And then I realized after I like the screw fell out, I was like, oh, fuck. That's why I took that sock off my other AK. Oh, and we put a new trigger in since Or I fucking put it in. Yeah. Yeah, the Zukov is pretty fucking cool, right? So I bought him a new stock for his birthday because I felt bad about giving him a shitty stock. Which I didn't care about. I was just going to buy another stock. But yeah, I got the... I cared about it. Side okay. folder now. Um, yeah, so it went from the... Piece of shit triangle stock to uh, I, I like the triangles, but no, this is this is pretty sweet. No, and we did. Uh, you can I, talk about your trigger when I go pee again. That's four. We need a fucking whiteboard. I'm gonna get a whiteboard for Justin's pisses. Um, so trigger. That's what we we're talking about. So I wanted the ALG trigger that Justin has in his, and we've been putting in at the shop, but. They are unobtainium right now. So Justin sold me on the Feem trigger, which... So right off the bat, I was like, it's a fucking two-stage. That's odd to me. Makes no sense in an AK. Now, I haven't shot it yet, so... He's talking to himself. Anyway, so... Uh, if I remember right, the take-up's like 1.78, and then the second stage is... Or, First stage is 1.7, second stage is 2.8. But you don't feel a difference in stages. Um, it just feels like a long take up. Right. Reset's not. 
not bad. And if you ride the reset, sick trigger. Yeah. Um, I think you'll like it with rounds in it. Yeah, but I'm stockpiling. No, wait. We don't endorse hoarding. No, <laughs> I'm kidding. I don't know. Uh, Justin's fondled it a lot. It's a mostly flat face trigger. Oh, geez. Can't see. There we go. Oh, oh. Mostly flat trigger. Just got a little hook at the bottom of the shoe. It's pretty. It feels good. It feels really good, actually. It really does. So, hopefully we're happy with it. Neither of us have played with it. Don't ask me why I haven't fucking shot it. I'm sure I've had 20 minutes somewhere. Oh, it's been raining and snowing and shit. Yeah. See, I was letting the bolt ride down slowly. Because you're a bitch. It's not how you... It's the microphone, dude. That's what the AK is for. Is that loud? Cracky. So instead of a shotgun racking it for home defense, just rack it in AK. Dude. 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 Like, who's in my house? Wow. That was a bit much. That Sorry. actually kind of hurt me. Sorry, man. You fired off my tinnitus. I can hear my ears <laughs> ringing already. Oh, dude, it is squealing bad. You're a dick. Sorry, man. Well, you know what? Keep calling me a dick. I'm going to take my stock back. You bought me the stock. <laughs> I know. I'm just kidding. Oh, you also did your little fuller sight deal. Oh, we'll yeah. You want to talk about that while I get the dog? But don't point a gun at me. Thank you, sir. Um. So, Jim Fuller, owner of Rifle Dynamics. Uh, he may not be the owner anymore. I think he sold it. But anyway. Uh, came up with this concept that... And it's true. Um, AK factory sites are square. The rear post. The rear post, yeah. And that kind of creates an optical illusion, which makes your front post harder to pick up. Um, this is very true. If you ever shot, tried to shoot range with an AK, even like 150 yards with iron sights, it's it's kind of hard to do. Um, and so he came up with this concept. You round out the edges, and it's. I'm not entirely sure. I went as far as he does. Now, I wasn't being cheap on this one. Like, I would have bought him. <coughs> and I still will if, if what I did didn't work. But I, I still need to blue him, too. But, um... We just need to get some Oxbow. Uh, I may have that. If you do, I need Maybe it. Maybe not. I need it in the shop. No, no. I buy it by the gallon, dude. Um, yeah, you did a really good job. Yeah, so I, I mean, I literally spent, I don't know, maybe an hour just rat tail files, just smoothing them out, rounding them down. You know, what? another thing I think he does is uh, widens the rear post gap. Oh, you didn't tell me that. I, I, just, mean, I just thought about it. I mean, I'll do it. Anything to be able to pick up that front post easier. Like, yeah. that's one of the reasons I never bought an AK. Is I can't pick up that hooded front sight it's at one, all. It's one of the only assault. Or, I don't want to say assault, right? No, assault um, rifle is fine. Assault weapon is bad. Uh, it's one of the only assault rifles that I have to shoot with one eye. Right. Right. Because the, the rear sight's so bad. And, I mean, you can see already, you can pick it up a little better. I know we're inside, but you can pick it up a little quicker yeah, with two eyes. Yeah, white tile. Yeah, but even with both eyes open, you can pick it up. I can't. Oh. Uh, if you were out a little further. That's right, Roden. I'm going to fucking shoot a thousand open sights with this fucking AK. I'm doing it. I don't give a shit. <laughs> I, first, I'm going to put a binary in there. Uh, second, I just dumps. Wait, I support you, bro. But I'm going to laugh. Like, every fucking round that you get frustrated. Because you're going to go through. No, I'm not going to get frustrated. I'm going to fucking laugh the whole time. Uh, two cases of ammo. No, our buddy Ron's sending me some nasty hot loads. <laughs> nasty hot, like barrel burners. <laughs> Like, uh, stupid hot. I'm telling you, bro. You're going to go through two cases before you even hit that fucking steel. So, I've never had an AK past uh, 250. I have hit... I, I've made hits at 250. Not I, hard, either. I can... Yeah, I believe that. Um, That's not playing with that fucking elevated side or anything. But, I don't know. I it It's something I'm going to try. You all right, bud? I love it. So I, I was thinking today, actually, I'm, I'm going to look for one of those retarded long lowers, the l stupid long front grips. Yeah. I'm going to get the one that's like way out here. SLR. Yes, the SLR. Yeah. 
I'm going to do it. Because then it's just going to look so fucking stupid. I'm going to wrap it with packy tape. Let's see. What color don't I have? So I need gray or... There's only like OD. three colors of packy tape, though. Blue. There's red, yellow. Orange. Orange. Yeah, there's there's a few. Purple. Oh, purple. It's getting purple. purple it's going to be called purple rain. Purple packy. Purple packy rain. <laughs> packy purple rain. <laughs> Collusion, man. Fuck you, Roden. Hey, Roden, you know what I can have that you can't? <laughs> a, real, <laughs> a real fucking gun. Or right, wait, let's just go grab. I mean, yeah. it's just right here. You can collusion all you want, bro. Just make it rain fucking mags. Just, uh, yeah. These are just oh. the new ones, Roden. Uh, oh, that's freedom, you California <laughs> Tommy fuck. <laughs> Let me see one of those. Which one? Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, you can't do that in California. <laughs> well, he can if it's fixed into the gun. Then he's got a rub on his. Yeah, fuck off. Oh, so look at this vintage shit. Gen Original P mags. mags still in the packaging. I got two. That's like, I like their shit. Can't have that in California. <laughs> got a fucking jail. Collude this month. Oh fuck, that mag's loaded. <laughs> Put it in the AK and let it rip. No, dude, that's not what okay. it is. I got a lot of mags just laying around. Fuck me. That's a good thing. It's yeah. kind of problems I like to have. Not talking shit now, are you? <laughs> Shut you right the fuck up. You have fun with your little <coughs> bullet button. I'll be tossing mags all day. Oh, he's telling Ron. So the collusion thing is he's telling Ron to fucking not make the, the burners for me. Oh, well, whatever. I don't care. I'll make it myself. I can do that. Jesus. There was never any stipulation on the ammunition. There was not. It was and the now Roden sending me. Roden, if this is a dick pic, I swear to fuck I'm going to California. No. <laughs> See? He's got him. Yeah, but you got a bullet button too. Is there a bullet button in there? Yep, that's a bullet button. <laughs> Fucking Geisley handguard? No. Yeah, it is. Where'd he go, Roden? They can sell those in California. He's got the O light on there. Don't need to call the ATF. What's up with your fucking front sight there, bud? Oh. <laughs> a fucking long range shooting California motherfucker to put a magpole imbus on backwards. Hey Justin, how do you put bipods on? <laughs> Why is that a joke? I put several bipods on and I put them on right every fucking time. I was just talking shit, bud. You guys been giving me shit about bipods. I don't understand. Just me and Scott. I don't get it. You're stupid inside jokes. Now you're a buddy buddy with one of the bosses. I don't like it. Is that a bad thing? It's not like I get a paycheck. <laughs> Fuck, man. Might as well make a friend. I'm just kidding. Um, yeah, dude, your your side's on. <laughs> <laughs> no way, man. It's for aerodynamics. So when he's running real fast and he's pointing out, it just pops the fuck up. <laughs> oh, come on. That's funny. For the love of God, Roden, switching around. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you worry about it. He says. Here, here you are posting on our account. <laughs> Yeah, he's posting he as a. You know, I'm fine with it. <laughs> I'm not because his imbus is on backwards. You went full retard, sir. Oh, I got to order that patch. Should we pause the show while I order a patch? Dude came in what yesterday with yeah. the patch that says you never go full retard. You gotta have it. Oh, we got a new patch. Where's the new patch? Yes. I kind of like that. I just lean it. Says nobody takes me pot of brass. That's fucking cool. Oh, that way. Patriot Patch Co. PatriotPatch.co, buy their shit. It's fucking awesome. We're not uh, sponsored or. Anything. We're just shills. We just... Oh, wait. You have to be sponsored to be a shill, right? I don't know. I don't Pull know what box. a shill is. But yeah, we, we love them. Good shit. Good patches. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Can't believe you got your embus on that. <laughs> fucking noob. Come spend a week with us, you piece of shit. We'll learn you something. No, dude, we would be such bad influences on Roden. He already—I'm not going to tell that inside joke. That's a—that's a cult joke. Never mind. 
Sorry, Roden. Anyway, at least we get your shit straight. See, that sounds even worse to me. No, I'm I'm gonna straighten your shit, bro. Oh, I wish. And figuratively. Don't just don't, dude. Like, <laughs> what the fuck's wrong with you? <laughs> How the fuck are we friends? I don't know. So we need to find one of those. Uh, what are those like? Yes, we need those sixty round AK mags that like wrap up yeah. under the handguards. Yeah. They, just weld, they just weld. They just weld. Oh, that's all homemade bullshit. Yeah. So it's kind of like the high point mags, the red balls. Yeah. You know. Oh, you got to like bust some Iraqi shit, Afghani shit. I mean, we can do it. It ain't gonna last very long, but we can do it. Yep, Roden, that's exactly what I was gonna say. Go fucking. <laughs> Is that what that means? Yes. Go fucking some bitch. <laughs> um, I bet you he can weld you up a stupid ass sixty round AK mag. He's bet a jeweler. He solders. Bet you did that when you were like six years old in your goat fucking country, didn't you? Wow. <laughs> Sorry. You always go racist, I'm sorry. you know that? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That was... See how we treat the people we like? Could you imagine, like, if we really didn't like somebody, how fucking awful would it be? Sorry. I don't fuck around with you dudes. <laughs> Blame as fuck. Uh, I love you, dude. I love your show, send it. Um, that raises a question. Where the fuck are they sending it? Apparently, they got like a PO or a, a mailbox. Apparently, they're sending lots of mail. So, are you shooting like forty-five long at distance or something? <laughs> Snail mail? Man, that's mean. Why are we being so mean to Rodan? I don't know. It's the end, but Dizzy, don't sniff magazine, or I guess do sniff magazines. Don't sniff me after you sniff a magazine. Yeah, he knows where they've been. You know, that's what's going to be next. There's going to be a run on magazines. Watch. We had a run on magazines oh. today. Yeah, but a small... Nobody buys 40s. Oh, yeah. No, Maybe no. I should buy some 40s. Nobody buys 40 round... Because you can't, like... It's like, true. You can't go prone with them. You can't go prone with 30s. No. No, you're not supposed to. Or, no. Well, okay, the people that do it are resting the mag as a bipod. And that's just dumb. Well, I have the uh, mag pods. I hate those. Why? They're great. You're not supposed to put any pressure on those mags. People oh, that grip by the mag. Shit. Bullshit. You can throw it out of battery that way. No, no. That's to do with the old models in, uh, import. Oh, it's not the mags. It's, it's the, the old rifle. That were just too loose. You're right. So the new ones, yeah. There's there's plenty of videos on YouTube that discount that already. Hmm. You, people that like resting the whole rifle. So then a 40 would be even better. I, I don't, because you got more of a. It's, it's not that it's, it's better. You're just sitting higher up on the optic, right. laying prone. A thirty round with a with the mag pod sits perfect at prone at eye level. Really? Right. I mean, you're right there. I think a forty round is it's just a little too high. Huh? I'm gonna buy a couple forties. Not like I mean, Mickey's, but I mean, we can fucking try it out. Uh, yeah, why not? I don't know. Fuck, we got we got fucking ARs in the shop. We'll try it out tomorrow. I'll lay on that dirty ass floor that I clean constantly. Because you brought in the fucking mud today. It's your fucking mud. It's from your driveway. It's not my fault. You parked in the muddiest fucking part I of my did driveway. Too. I did, too. And then you start cursing me because like your driveway's fucking muddy. Well, yeah, you parked over there where the water runs and pulls. It's not even and, on your driveway anymore. That's and, your, that's and your front dirt. It creates a fucking pond. And then I tried to kick off my shoes to be polite <laughs> to get in your car. <laughs> Fucked up my new shoes. <laughs> Oh, hell no. I'm not coming <laughs> here with <a> new shoes. <laughs> Dude, we got to stop listening to Pra. Uh, or, yeah. Uh, Roden, I run the full 30. Never had full a problem. Full 30, bro. Never, ever, ever had a problem. I don't uh, I don't believe in that hype shit of 29. A lot of people do. A lot of people run 28. A lot of people are always around down, at least. Never had a problem. I'm, I'm around up, bro. I put 31 in my 30s. Uh, was it the Masada mags I was stuffing 18 into? <laughs> yeah. I can stuff 18 into those 17 round mags you and they st- run. You can stuff 31 in a 30 round magazine. You can shave down the fucking follower and you can get an extra. You can remove the follower and get an extra <laughs> Just 10. ride the spring? Ain't gonna fit so well. 
No, seriously, I've I've always topped them off. I yeah, but I use that that mag loader. Um, I don't know if that. I doubt that makes a difference. What is it called? The Uplula or whatever. Uplula. Yeah. Yeah. But I wonder if that fits on AK mags. Hmm. Have to test that shit. I like AK mags. Oh, I gotta break these other ones in, dude. See, look. Uh, I'll try to show this on the video. Rounds it off. That's a new one. Yeah. Fucking that sentry destroys mags. What else? I still like it. What else, yo? So I decided we're bringing back like nine. That's okay. I don't really feel like spending fifty bucks on a fucking magazine. I do. You do it all the time. Waffles. I said that. Thank you, not another gun cast for correcting my it's, corrected. It's all about the waffles. Oh, I fucking forgot you had that. Yeah, nobody's commenting on my shirt either. Fuck, Fuck your shirt. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> You're hey, just on a fucking hey, hate the audience you thing. You didn't comment on my fucking 80% TP post. Kit. Shit. Fuck. You're not commenting on my fucking... I'm, just, I'm done. I was just playing. I'm just staring in horror. Oh, no. Like, sheer horror. I'm sorry. I love the way we try to do fucking stories. And Stephanie works so hard and puts in a fuck ton of stories. We just start talking shit. Have we read one story? She's put- oh, yeah. Yeah. Man, yeah. Like well, no. Uh, so our, our new friend Jesse came in today. We took him shooting, him and Abby. And he and I, what Anyway, fucking taught a night course. We're not good at names. We are awful. Fucking, I so barely remember Roden. If we uh, butchered your uh, names. One what, Tyler? Anyway, so... They came into the shop today to pick up a P365. Oh, it's, uh, oh, the shirt. Black Rifle Division. He thinks. Yeah, no. Black Rifle um, Division. Anyway, they came into the shop and Jesse, like, right off the bat, it's like, dude, we listened to your show. I laughed for a fucking hour straight. You guys were fucking talking about well, first off, that's five. The, the, bo- the five. boss was here, there. And he's <laughs> like, hey, we subscribed to your show. And I'm like, oh, fuck. Here we go. Fuck. And he's like, we laughed for an hour. I'm like, oh. Hey, what am I going to talk about while you're on? Whatever you want to. Your show. Your fucking urinary issues? It's right on the fucking boss. Just stay in there. I don't know. All right, let me fucking find something. Like, I get warning about his dumb ass. Uh, online, re- online ammo retailer sued over Santa Fe high school shooting. Oh, wow. I fucking missed that one, too. So I'm not going to, uh, not going to go into that. I think he died. Let's hope. <laughs> Son of a bitch, I missed a bunch of these. Fuck me, I was busy this week, dude. I missed a bunch of these yeah, stories. I know. Six five by fifty two Carcano. Ooh, revived by <coughs> Steinal ammunition. Fuck yes. What is it? Uh six five by fifty two uh Carcano. Has been revived by Steinal Ammunition. I think it's Carafano. No, there's no more fucking uh, vowels in there, but okay. No, that's great. For the fucking Arasakas and shit. Oh, that's cool. Dude, I gotta fucking catch up on these. Hey, we had two weeks. Like, we had two weeks of stories and two weeks to catch up on it because you insisted that I take my birthday off. Which, fucking whatever. <coughs> which we basically just went to sleep. Right. Like, not together, but... Yeah. Oh, no, you had some... That was the week you had some shit. Yeah. Some shit on your shit. Yeah. Anyway. That's not important. Not to even. this audience. No. No, it was funny, because, like, I was literally, like, falling asleep standing up. I was so tired. Mm-hmm. And then I ended up standing up until, like, 5 o'clock that morning. Mm-hmm. Because dealing with some other shit. And I yeah. picked you up in the morning and drove us to work, and you fucking slept. All like, the way to work. Assed out, snoring like a motherfucker. <laughs> Dude, I had the radio turned so far down, I could barely hear it. I was like, I ain't waking this bitch ass up. You were sitting in the chair at work, just... It was bad. It was <sighs> bad. I mean, it was fucking... It was funny to me, because we drank the same amount that night, even though we weren't, like, drinking like, heavy. No, we were, like, we weren't even, like... Like, we weren't drinking, drinking. No. We just it was were having like, a few beers. Legit, like, we were being good because we had to go to work the next day, and... You were just... Fucked. I was... Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. Five in the morning, and I picked you up at 8.30. Yep. Oof. 
That was a tough one. That took me like two or three days to get over. I I believe that. You fucking suffered, man. Like, I took over everything that day. You really did. And, like, I should have been the one that was fuckered. Like, oh, it's your birthday. <laughs> but we were both, like, so fun. Duh. Like, you were assed out on my couch. Like, 8.30? Like, yeah. No, we looked at the phone. We're like, it's 8.30? It feels like 11. Yeah. Both of us, dude. We're like, <coughs> <laughs> like, what time is it? <coughs> Fuck, it's 8.30. Yeah. This is like, goddamn midnight. Dude. And then you crashed out, and then, like, my phone started blowing up. No, 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 no. That started before I fell asleep. Because I did pull out the couch. Yeah, that's right. That's right. I mean, like, I, yeah. 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 Anyway. Funny story, but. Uh, Not not funny? Not for. for, But not for non-family? Yeah. Or. Yeah. We might as well fucking be family. Fucking homo. Yeah. Right. Anyway. Nitrous is for fags. I disagree. It says cubic inches. <laughs> I gotta stop watching movies, man. Man, uh, you know what? I don't care. It's our show. Fucking watching Goon the other night. God damn, good. Goon's amazing. It's good. Good shot. Oh, fucking Trailer Park no, Boys in there and everything. Not, not to be confused with Goonies. Goon. Also amazing, but Goon is way more entertaining. God, fuck it. what's his name? Sean William Scott. Yeah. That guy is just so fucking funny. Dude. If you haven't seen Goon, I don't give a fuck if you like hockey or not. Go watch Goon. Goon is great. That is good stuff. Good friendly or family friendly. Quality fun. family entertainment. Definitely watch it with your kids. Just like our show is family friendly. Same thing. Yeah. Same thing. Same and same. different. But different. But still same. You're having a lot of fun with that, aren't you? I will ride that pony till it dies. Like, you're riding a pony? Like, you call Rodan a go-fucker and you're riding a pony? I'm a fucking cowboy, bro. Like, um, like Kid Rock's a cowboy, or... I told you, I'm bringing back the 90s shit. It's gonna happen anyway. (laughs) Like, Kid Rock's a cowboy. Kid Rock was raised in Detroit. Remember that song, though? I I actually saw a horse growing up, okay? Yeah, I rode a horse growing up, I think. (laughs) I'm just saying. Save a horse, ride a cat. No. That sounds awful. I saw that band. They're shit. <laughs> Do we want to talk about gun shit at all tonight? We have been a lot, actually. Probably uh, more tonight than we ever have. I mean, we haven't been booted from anything yet, so I'm kind of pissed. Oh! I'm kind of pissed that we haven't lost our revenue stream. I want to tell a funny story about being booted and shit. So I told you about this. So me, a friend and I, another friend, uh, we were fucking lit up one night, so we made a fucking trolling uh, Tinder profile. Oh yeah, that's right. That's with right. my fucking picture, on it. <laughs> like I've already been booted from Facebook, YouTube. Let's see if I can get banned from fucking Tinder too. <laughs> like that profile lasted an hour, <laughs> just trolling the fuck out of Tinder. That was so those pretty fucking you, mean. So those of you that are actually trying to find love. There are assholes out there like this guy that are just... The profile lasted an hour. Catfishing you like a motherfucker. I didn't just, catfish fucking just anybody. Safe, okay? Just be safe. Wait, I thought Tinder wasn't looking for love. Broke back cowboy? Yeah. Come on, get the pun. Roden's doing good, I man. I know. I don't appreciate it. I appreciate that about him. <laughs> anyway. I, I appreciate it. Um, That's better. Yeah. So, yeah. Can we make, like, a hammer and sickle thing? Wait, I got an idea. We'll talk about that tomorrow. Probably not, because I'll fucking forget. Um, Never mind. We know somebody with a vinyl cutter. I need some fucking hammers and sickles for this. It's oh, Romanian, though. It's not great. I don't give a fuck. Get the Romanian flag if you're going to do something. Ew, like, that's like, boring. Like, make it true to its country. True to its origin country? Okay, be one of those guys. I told you, it's got to be ugly and stupid. <gasps> no, I'll just, spray, <gasps> I, I'll just spray paint some mags. I'll fucking make a little stencil. That's If you're going to do it, fucking rattle can it. Yeah. It's going to look like shit, but you'll get the idea. Can we eBay like 90s uh, stickers? And just yeah. Like, like laminate it into the wood or something. like. like battle I mean, paper. I can actually do that. Huh. Oh, we're supposed to start fucking making our own furniture. I totally forgot about that. These fucking seven people care. Oh, sorry, six. 
Sorry. I thought you guys were a bit more, you know. <clears throat> Sorry. Do you want to tell your story about you getting kicked off of work the other day? Uh-uh. I think you should. I think it's Mm-mm. funny. That's a slack thing. And motherfucker, I got a cop. <laughs> <coughs> That's a slack thing? Okay. So, if you want to hear the story about how he get, got kicked off his job the other day. I didn't get kicked off. Ah. That hurts. If you want to hear the story of why he left his other his job the other day, we never talked about this. Do we care? What is it? Oh, your leave? Your loophole? Loophole? Yeah, man. Oh, I, I want remember. to talk about your fucking job the other day. Good for you, bitch. Oh no, no, Tyler. We already did. I'm taking it back, so we're not doing. I'm bringing it back either. No, that's how we got booted off Facebook for hate speech. <laughs> never mind. It came back. Um, so I acquired Jesus. We can't. I might need a second. (coughs) Yeah, we tried doing take backs once and we got booted from Facebook's. I called you a fucking porch monkey. Yeah, because you were trying to take it to the back. I'm taking it back. I don't care. Anyway, so it's still all mounted and shit, but I, uh, yeah, rodent later. Oh, it's still coming. Oh, it's coming. Yep, take over on that. I need a second. You know the story. So, Mark's got the coronavirus, apparently. I'm probably going to have to shoot him. Just to be safe. We don't want to be quarantined. <laughs> We're gonna, probably going to have to make a suicide pact. Which blows, because... I was in the same room with him. Does that make me sick? What? Huh? Were you talking to me the whole time? Kind of. I didn't hear shit, dude. I think we got to do a suicide pack now because you got the coronavirus. So I kill you, you kill yourself? <laughs> Fuck off. Heads <laughs> I win, tails you lose. <laughs> Woo, grandpa's cough medicine. Come on. Anyway, so... I get a cold every year on my birthday. We'll do part of the story. Birthday was last week. I caught a nasty cold on Monday. Then my allergies kicked in on Tuesday. (laughs) So I am just getting the clusterfuck of go kill yourself. During like the worst scare of any pandemic in the worst. Like worst over fucking played (laughs) piece of shit ever. So my life is just kind of like, hey, I mean, I clear out lines at Walmart though. (laughs) <laughs> that was a good meme too huh that's actually a really good glass my friend well yeah so we talked about the rifle I acquired I believe um but the Delton I acquired had this uh, loophole oh, VX2 three? on it uh 3 by 9 nothing super duper fancy about it but son of a bitch that's a really good optic yeah. Now, I'm not a second focal plane guy. Um, and, you know, no adjust. I mean, the turrets are adjustable, but no exposed turrets. I nothing like fancy. It. Like, I honestly think I'm going to put a fucking $350 scope on a 22, man. Like, it's. Oh, oh. So we got another loop pulled in for a rifle I'm building at the shop. Yeah. Uh, what is it called? The, the long range precision, I think. Mm-hmm. Holy shit, we played with that thing? Uh, second focal plane. Uh, a, a capped windage turret, which makes total fucking sense. Right. Like, you hold for windage. Well, there are certain times. Anyway. Holy shit. Uh, what was... MSRP was something like nine-ish? Yeah. Right. Uh, I think it's the VX3i Long Range Precision. I'm really happy with that glass. It's... Very, very good for the price. Um, Loophole, I mean, yeah, they don't make Mark Fives anymore. Um, they have a different version of the Mark Fives, though. But, man, this is like the second Loophole I've ever had. I forgot how good they are. It's a good tube, bud. Is that PSR Is that what talk? she said? I was trying to talk about your PSR guy. Oh, you're saying, like, PRS guys call it a tube? I don't know. Just, I mean, I'm just trying to be like hockey talk, but like 
long range. I was just trying to be cool. You should really just stop trying. I mean, we know you don't try with anything else. It's a good tube, bud. Anyway, so... um, Yeah, I'm happy with it. I need to get it off this base and everything, but... Tyler. Let's go to Tyler's question. Where's Tyler? Speaking of coronavirus, what's the best guns that I have? Uh, all of them. So what you want to do is you want to load your shot shells with Lysol or uh, Purell, <laughs> Purell and just smoke every <laughs> cocksucker you see in Walmart. Do you hear that? Yeah. We've had military choppers and planes flying by for days. <gasps> Get out the night vision. You guys hold the fuck on. We're going to go. No, we're, no, we're not. not. Um, we don't want to die. Dude, 9 mil is cheapest. Right now. As Get. of yesterday. 223 um, and 556. 762 is going slowly. No, 762 is gone. Uh, by 39. Sorry. Yeah. That that was gone a week ago. Is that really outside? Yeah. It's a helicopter. You been watching Trailer Park Boys? Um, That's what Bubble says. Dude, now's not the time to buy a gun. I'm telling you. Just. <laughs> if you don't have one now. That was not a helicopter. Um, you, You're going to have to wait. Days, it's gonna be days. I, you know, what? we'll post an update tomorrow. We'll figure out how we can do it without causing any problems. We tried to take a picture of the wait times, but there was some names in there still through the block that we put on it. Right. Um. Honest to God, just like, <coughs> now is not the time to buy. Just ammo and mags. I mean, if you if you got something, buy the same ammo, buy more mags for what you got now. But honest to God, do not. Go to your gun shop and try to buy a gun right now. Well, I don't know. You, th- you every can. state's the same, yeah. You can. I mean, <coughs> you're gonna there, be waiting like it's California, though. There's gonna be long Rotary. wait times, and you're gonna have a hard time finding ammunition. Is that a vibrator? Like they dropped one on the floor upstairs? Or did you hide a vibrator in my room again? <laughs> yeah, you dick. Um, but yeah, nine millimeter anything. Um, I would suggest Glock, Sig. HK. Um, what else you got? You said HK. Um, FN. FN is on more on the expensive side. Mm. Um, IWI by fucking Masada. I, IWI Masada, fucking great, cheap gun, not cheap, inexpensive, inexpensive, um, incredible fucking pistol for the shoots price. Like a fucking dream. I cannot believe that thing. Um. Yeah. What what's the MSRP on those like four fifty something like that? Uh, four seventy five. I yeah. think. So I I you I Masada if you can find it. Most places will order it for you. They can get it through their distributor. Yeah. Everybody uses fucking RSR. Yeah. Um. Oh, that's that's the way to go. CZP one. Yeah, dude, but not everybody can get a CZ. The PO ones aren't too pricey. I've been telling you that. I've been telling you we should get them. But we got to run that through the chain of command. Yeah. Um, chain of command likes the IWIs though, so that's good. Uh, what? There's something else I'm thinking of. Um, Buy all the XDs because we don't fucking want them. Oh, they go bang. I mean, no XDs work fine. I I ran fuck, one for if years. You can, if you can find a high point right now, I bet the high points are out there. I'm saying, like, pawn shop, high point right now. 98 per, or let's go, 94% of high points fucking work every time. Yeah. Six. God damn you. Six, dude. You know, and. Wait, in my defense, how many energy drinks did I drink today? One. Two. That's bullshit. No. Anyway, uh. So. In California, where Roden is, the CZP01 is the same as a Glock. So what is that, like 2,500 Roden? Just saying. No. Um, also, Roden said, uh, the where'd he go? Army just picked up the new Mark V as their scope for their snipers. Fuck yes, they did. And I have not handled the new Mark V yet. I've seen them listed. I kind of just want to buy one. Because um, the old Mark Vs were just amazing. Um, but honestly, you know what? what? I want to change my answer. What answer? You have answers? Yes. I want to change my answer to Tyler's question. 
here's the deal. If you don't own a handgun now, go to your store. Like, uh, go to a sportsman's warehouse or something. See also, how, what the fuck's wrong with you? Oh. See how much ammo they have of a certain caliber on the cell, shelf. Say it's 38 special. 357 SIG. So he's, for 357 SIG. 44 special. Um, whatever is it, like an off ammo that they have the most of, buy that fucking handgun. Buy that caliber handgun. And buy all that ammo. And buy all that ammo right now. That's, and then that's my answer. And then when shit settles down, sell it. Get what or, you want. Or keep, hold on or to hold it. Hold on to it. Right. I don't sell shit. You sell shit. Right. I don't sell anything. I it I mean my safe is I'm a, I'm over, a Wheeler so. dealer kind of dude. Like I you're like, a pawn shop I guy. Like it. I said that today. Yeah. In front of a customer. <laughs> I like it. But yeah, that's that's my answer after actually like thinking about it for a minute. No, that's um, absolutely that is correct. And now make sure it's something that is at least remotely comfortable to you. Right. Don't go with like fucking 500. No, no, no. Okay. You're saying like 500 mag. Don't, right. don't buy a fucking. That's what I'm, I'm exaggerating. But don't buy yeah. a Smith and Wesson in 500 mag and expect that to function for you. Unless you're a fucking beefcake. Right. I'm, that, that was an exaggeration, but yeah, you've got to right. find like 38 special, 357 mag. Um, fucking 38 super. No. Dude. Yeah. Super low recoil. Right. But good luck affording the pistol. I mean, really, you're going to buy an STI and you're out five grand. Right. But so, honestly, yeah. go buy a fucking 1911. They're they're cheap. They're everywhere. 1911s are cheap. 45 right? has not gone crazy yet. No, 45 still sitting. We, we, like, we have not seen a surge in 45. We sold like four boxes today. Yeah. That's Opposed pretty, to the 30. Of everything else. Cases of 9 mil that we saw walk out today. Dude, we smoked 9 mil. Like, and we're both lowish on 9 mil. We're not like scary low. There it is again. Yeah, we got enough to... Oh, we'll get through, and yeah. there's a press right there. So, yeah. Ooh, and I might have a 1050 on the way. And and you might get a deal on something too, like mm -hmm. you know, especially if it's obscure right now. 38 special, let's say, or 357 man. I'll make you, you a smoking deal on 38 special right now. Right now, I. <laughs> you come into my shop right now. You got a 38 special smoking I fucking deal. Fucking got you. I've said that before on the show. I think. We're we're turning into a commercial. Um, um, but yeah, that's that's it, man. Like, find, go to the shop, go look at his shelves, see what ammo is left. And if it's a fuck ton of double up four ten, buy a goddamn judge. Dude, Who cares? Do it. They work. Yeah, a Taurus judge forty five long colt four ten shotgun shell. If Even you better. can't if you can't find forty four long colt four ten is did I say forty four? You did uh, forty five long colt. Yeah. All day, though. Um, Even better. A Smith and Wesson governor, yeah, that has the moon clips for forty five yeah, auto. Yeah. That's gonna run. Yeah, I mean they're both. I will never say no to a little gun. Uh, we have one on the way that doesn't function that we're gonna destroy. Ooh, finally I got a gun to drive over. <laughs> yeah, so that's my answer for that. I'm sorry. Absolutely the best video. answer possible for the first time fucking ever out of you. What? No, I, I mean, congratulations. That's a fantastic fucking answer. Like, bravo, dude. I I didn't even consider that. I mean, that's... There right, are so many options. right now, that's where yeah. it's at. Yeah. If it's a fucking J-Frame and 44 Special and they got 50 boxes on the shelf, take it. Right. And take all the boxes. Just... It is plan, the time to spend the money because guess on what? Spending some fucking money. If it goes, if it goes really, really, really bad, and you're hurting for you know TP's fucking forty bucks a roll, and you're hurting for it, guess what? Hawk that J frame. You get five grand out of a fucking J frame. Me? I got a bidet. <laughs> you know what? Hey, entertain them. Watch this. I don't know what's going on right now. You don't want to do. Apparently, I don't want to. But yeah, that's it. And rifle, same thing. Uh, if you got, if there's 100 boxes of 22, buy a fucking 22. I'm not kidding. I have a bidet. That's all a bidet is. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I never fucking looked at it. How does it open? There it is. Oh, fuck. It's literally not open. So we all know I talk a lot of shit. So I talked so much shit to a guy one day that he sent me a bidet. That's a bidet. Huh. 
Okay, let's do some fucking. Huh, huh, huh. So that blows water out of your bum hole, huh? I guess it washes your ass crack. I don't know, bud. Never used it. Well, you might. <laughs> I might. <laughs> Dab off a fucking. That might paper be towel over here to take a shit. You might be. It's <laughs> like. <laughs> You know what? I bet if we post pictures of that, it'll beat your fucking uh, 80% shit. I got a poo. I got a poo. <laughs> I got the poo on me. Joe Dirt. That's... <laughs> oh, man. We yeah. we never stop quoting movies. Right. We can go a little longer. Yeah, I'm okay with it. For once. Yeah. What was it? Two weeks ago, you're like, fucking done. I'm fucking done, bud. Uh, uh, no, I... Dude, that, that was the weekend. No, that wasn't the weekend of your birthday. That was the weekend before. Yeah, no, you refused to do a show on my birthday. Well, I, I mean, we needed a break. Like, it's been, well, since November. Our last break was in November yeah. on your birthday. You wanted to do a show that night. You wanted to do a show on <laughs> your night. Yeah, but I was sober. You were shit-tossed by, like, 2 o'clock. It's not my fault my birthday was on a Saturday. I was on a Friday. I went to work at two jobs. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. Oh, no. I only went to one job that day. Never mind. Yeah. My but bad. No, we we kind of needed a little mental health holiday. Hiatus. Yeah. Uh, you know, we're going through a lot of fucking effort right now, but we're going to hang in there, right? We're going to bang it out. I don't know. I'm pretty much fucking done with you people. What do you mean, you people? I'm bringing it back. You know what? <laughs> so all this shit for me is like, you know when you're watching stand-up and the comedian makes himself laugh? When we make ourselves laugh, it makes me really happy. I know. That's 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 my whole meaning of life, is just to make you happy. What is that on the top of your shelf of the Nutcracker head? Uh, the Super 77? That's the uh, spray glue I used for that. Oh, okay. To wrap the felt on the... Uh... On the MDF. Gotcha. Yeah, so I saved that because you wanted me to build you a wall. But you want me to pay for your wall. Yeah. Kind of a dick move, but... I know. Like... Never said I was a good guy. Neither did anybody else ever. That's kind of... I like that cam. I mean, for all the fucking free work I give you, you should pay for your own fucking wall. I don't know about that. I got a fancy Glock shirt today. You did? Haven't even opened it. Glock stocking dealer shirt. Pretty cool, right? Yeah. Even you know, though I'm basically nothing. You know what else that means? It's like... I gotta learn about Glocks? Uh, No, but you will eventually become a Glock armor. Oh, absolutely. Because will. we are a Glock stocking dealer. Yes. Homie, I'm professional. <laughs> If, if everybody out there doesn't watch the show Dave, watch the show Dave. Don't be plugging fucking Hulu series. I don't give a fuck. It's FX, but we like Lil Dicky. He funny. Yeah. Let's get that last episode. Fucking hilarious, dude. Like, not much makes me, like, snort and cry <laughs> laughing. <laughs> the last 30 seconds of that episode, dude, I almost pissed myself. I was oh. laughing so hard. And not a word was said. Well, it was like, I guess I'll park in the street. Yeah. Yeah. Six words. And it was like, dude, I laughed for like 20 minutes after the episode. Oh, dude, even, yeah. Yeah. Fucking, it was hilarious. It's funny. Oh, man. Yeah. No one was a good one. The fucking sex doll. Ask. Where's the torso? First off, that was a that, that was, was a like long, three questions. That was like three questions. Number one, <laughs> he goes through them all too. Like, I, don't I don't know where the rest of the torso I is. I don't know anything about the torso. Oh fuck! Oh, dude. <laughs> it's still fucking funny. I Dave. watched it again yesterday. Fucking Dave on Hulu, Little Dicky the rap like. Oh man, he's yeah. just. If you guys don't know who Little Dicky is, YouTube him. Um, oh, just, dude, fuck. Watch uh, dude, Save That Money. Dude spits. Hot fire, say it. Just say it. He's you fucking, want to. He's hot fire. Uh, <laughs> hey, you never talked about this. 
Oh, this? You mean oh. this hat that no one can get? I mean, I can. You really can't. What? Unless. I'll steal it when you sleep with me. <laughs> so when you buy a Legion uh, series sig, you get special access. Like you register it and you get like cool shit. Um, you only get uh, you can only buy certain things if you uh, register your Legion through Sig, which makes it even cooler because not everybody can get it. <laughs> and everybody knows I'm kind of a peacock. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, Legion series hat. Uh, you got the Legion symbol. It's a... Uh, let me take off my hat and show my bald head. Ah, look at the glare. The uh, glare. Oh. Uh, Bill Brothers or Bandit Brothers or whatever. Um, whatever. I don't even know who these people are. I don't either, but uh, they're a logo. Logo. And then you got the uh, Sig Sour logo on the back. But what I like is the subdued. Yeah, they can see it. The subdued Legion symbol. A Sig Sour. Yeah. So when you buy a Legion oh, series, sure. when you buy a Legion series pistol, you get access to the Legion shop. Uh, Colian Noir called it the tactical Inu Illuminati, which is, you know, he's getting better. Which I, is fair. There was a time like I couldn't stand the shit that dude was putting up. Fucking hiccups though. Anyway. He was just putting out fucking NRA propaganda for you so really long. Do you really do have the coronavirus. Sure, why not? He's, I'm fucking patient zero. He's a sick ma. Why are you doing... I gotta put him down, ma! I've always said, some motherfucker, when I'm, like, decrepit, better take me out to pasture. And if it's you, I'm gonna be pissed. I'll do it. No, you better die before me. Be Actually, like, I'm gonna make sure you die before me. be like some old yeller shit. Yeah, man. Like, I gotta put him down, Ma. You know, fuck that. I'll put myself down. Like when the time comes, <laughs> he's got, he's got the hiv, Ma. He's got the kids, Ma. <laughs> oh, it's a shadow. Like you see the on my pant leg there. Oh, looks like a brown it spot. A, like thought it was a poo stain. I did not wipe with my fucking pants. Um, but no, I mean, really, when the time comes, if I'm gonna get shot by my own gun, I'm pulling the trigger. Yeah. Would think, you rather? I think uh, we should make a pack now. Ugh. Homo. That uh, when we're 85 years old. God, I don't want to make it that far. We duel. <gasps> kind of okay with that. In the cemetery. <gasps> Even better. Can we do it in Tombstone? Shake on it. In Tombstone? Uh, okay, if we can make it to Tombstone. We have kids. Fucking <laughs> just drive me to Tombstone, son. I mean, my kids will be in their fucking <laughs> 60s. Oh, shit. Well, let's shake on it right now in front of God and everybody. 85 I mean, years old. God and seven people. <laughs> we make it to 85. We go to a cemetery somewhere. A seminary? We go to a cemetery somewhere and we have a duel. Can we play Cemetery Gates from Pantera? I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Come on, dude. That would be... I have had two great ideas tonight, which entitles me to another piss. That is fucking seven. You do not get to knock one off for that, you fucking moot. Oh, shit. <laughs> Bye, Facebook. <laughs> so, no joke. This is literally how we talk to each other. Oh, I hate saying literally. This is how we talk to each other all day at a gun store in front of customers and they spend... <laughs> yes, Stephanie, that is a fantastic fucking idea. I, for once, I will give him props. I No, for twice. Wow. I hate myself right now. Might have to go cut my wrist. Um, this is just how we are. This is not us playing a persona. Like, we are actually not putting on a show. This is just how fucked up we are. No shit. That's kind of sad. You know, so look at the YouTube one. Oh, Duel is a fantastic idea. Fuck yeah, it is. It really is, man. All like, I have are fantastic ideas. That is not true, yes. ever. 
but twice tonight. What is with you? Good I job, man. Who has diabetes? Who has diabetes? Probably me. That's why I pee so much. I mean, the gut says maybe. <sighs> well, that just means I won't make it to 85 and we won't have our duel. Otherwise, what do I win if you don't make it to 85? Absolutely nothing. Uh, oh. We'll talk about That's that. That's fair, actually. We'll talk about that off camera. I, I mean, like, we're going to have to sell our saves before we hit 85 because, like, we don't have retirement plans. Like, we're not. I kind of do. I kind of did. I, I, you know my. Oh, I do know. Plan. <gasps> Can you show the John Wick? No. Oh. Nope. I'm not even talking about it. The John Dick, that's what I said. So we know this dude named John <laughs> likes to show his dick. <laughs> How do we stay like on this stuff? I don't know. Like, we should get booted every episode. These six people that listen to us like keep us on here every weekend. We're doing it for you, motherfuckers. Guess Honestly, what? we were like driving home and we're like, do we even want to do a show tonight? And we're like, oh, we kind of have to. So, so our our weekend this weekend involves gun store from gun store hours to the podcast on Saturday. Well, and then gun store hours on Friday. Previously, of course. And then, and then we worked at the new store all week, all week. Fucking hanging drop grid. And, oh my god, stuffing insulation. Construction work. Which it's fine. Don't give a fuck. Drop grids are kind of dumb, but anyway, um, so we did Friday. We did today. So tomorrow, we go to gun store hours. Then we run a CCW class until fucking nine thirty. Yeah, four hour, four hour class. And After, then I go to my real job on Monday yeah. and hang fucking drywall for and eight I'm, hours. And I'm probably gonna have to go back to the gun shop. You gotta on finish Monday. that grid. Well, I'm talking about the old one. To to get people that to fucking dispose guns. Gun, firearms, yep, yep. Man, so. I feel so bad for people buying firearms right now. So we talked about it, like first thing this morning. I was like, should we just put in fucking <laughs> right. submit, like just in case in case we want a gun? Right. Like, I mean, my bank account fucking hates me because of this job, but goddamn, dude, it's getting dirty. I know this is like the fourth time, guys. I'm sorry. It's it's no joke. Like it's not a joke. It's dead you thought TP was bad. Shit. Just wait. It, like if you if you seriously thought toilet paper was a problem, Ammo. first off, get a bidet. Oh, so I wasn't even worried about fucking toilet paper or anything. But when I, I when we watched the fucking ammo yesterday from on our suppliers, what the was numbers it? just like, plummet. It was like ten o'clock our time. Yeah, to five o'clock when we closed. It was just like. It was and, like watching the stock market just collapse. And we had a heads up that just was like order. Just we had four order. four people on four different distributor websites buying up as much ammo as we could. Yeah. And uh we barely got enough for maybe the next <laughs> two months, yeah. maybe. And yeah. if I oh we can't we can't talk about the stuff that he told us. I'm guess I don't know. He told us, is it public knowledge? The virus is supposed to last a long time, according to the CDC. You which, can say the day. Uh, 537 days is supposed to be the lifetime, which it started in October. So. And so we got a while. Now, obviously, that that's doesn't move mean, from continent to continent. Right. That doesn't mean that the panic buy is going to last that long. Shit's going to probably start to resurface eventually. Right. But... It was like, uh, what we wait? The swine flu lasted five hundred and thirty six days or something like that. that what no, did? no, no, no. It was it was a year and a half. Yeah. Uh, so it was a little longer, but he got buried. So if you want to get your tinfoil hat, which God damn, I need to keep one. I said this last week <laughs> or the week before. Sorry. Uh, you know, it got buried under other things and blah blah blah. So who knows how it's actually going to turn out? Right. I don't really care fucking cold sorry if you're in your 80s and you're listening to this shit and i offended you <laughs> the fuck is wrong with you yeah, yeah like i don't feel bad no. no i mean 60 plus we do have you look at looked at our analytics we have like we have 65 plus on there we got boomers 
Is that boomers? Sorry, boomers. You, if you get CBD or is this CBD? COVID. 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 Nineteen. Yeah, if you get it, sorry, bro. I mean, even if they get it, they're probably okay unless they have pre-existing respiratory problems. We, between the two of us, we know way too many healthcare professionals. We know <laughs> right. way too many inside people. Yeah. Um, we know, fuck, we know too many people. Um, but the panic button, it's just that it's a fucking panic. It's just calm your tits for real. Do I have tits? I mean, I know you have tits. God damn it. <laughs> Not appropriate. Are you fucking shitting me after all the fucking bullshit we said? Tits and yours. That really hurts my feelings, okay? What fucking feelings? The feelings that I do have when you talk about my man movies. Your moves. It hurts, man. It hurts. Hey, you go to the gym like twice a month? I was going religiously until all this fucking Dude. shit happened. Like we're, I, I'm really not bitching. But shit has gotten fucking wild. How many times have I ran across the county? Mm -hmm. Like, literally. Mm -hmm. Literally across the county. Not even figuratively. <laughs> Not even figuratively. Across the goddamn county. Two or three times a goddamn day. But you know how much better our life's going to be in like a month? Yeah, absolutely. It's all worth it. Or hopefully. But... Maybe I'll even get a paycheck. <laughs> You know, honestly, like, I have never, ever, ever considered working for free until it was this thing. And I'm like, fucking, I love it. That was I me. I love dude. it. So. Like, dream job, almost. When when I got this job, I was going to school for gunsmithing. Yeah. And I. And you were working at the. A humane Society. Okay. I didn't know if you wanted to. Um, and uh, so <laughs> I was like. There, there was options to intern for, like, if you could find a shop to intern at, you got, like, extra credit or whatever. And so I happened to buy a few parts from the shop yeah. for projects for yeah. class. And uh, it just so happened that the owner is a uh, Durango Police Department officer. Mm -hmm. Got called because one of the fucking receptionists... Oh. Accidentally hit the panic button with her knee because we're. I told you about yeah, this when yeah, we were yeah, talking yeah. about the new shop, and that's when you started talking to yeah, yeah. So they would like fidget with her knees or whatever, and there was no protective thing on the panic button, right? So cops would roll in probably two or three times a month, fucking shotguns, everything, like SWAT, SWAT team yeah. shit. So that kind of happened, and uh, you being a social butterfly that you are, the bot, the my boss rolled in. And I was like waiting for him at the door. I knew it was coming. Yep. And I was like, hey, guys, we're good. This dumb bitch fucking hit it with her knee. And so like uh, his partner that he was with wanted to go look at the dogs. And he's like, God damn it. And so like I took him on a tour of the facility. And I would talk to my boss. I was like, hey, dude, I'm going to the school. Like we had already talked after buying parts and stuff for yeah. projects. And he knew what I was doing. I was like, I could use some intern hours. And he's like, cool, you start on this day. Damn. And uh, How do I not know this story? <laughs> I don't know. So that's how it started. And I uh, I worked under another guy. Uh, mm -hmm. And that's not there anymore. And he taught me a bunch of shit about ARs and then 308 AR-15s. And I actually learned more. Did you mean to say AR-10s? Did I say AR-15? You just said 308 AR-15s. Yeah, I meant AR-10s. Oh, okay. Um, so I actually learned more through him than I actually did. Through school. Through school. Right. And it was hands-on. Like, I was actually building shit right. at the time. And, yeah, so it was great. And it worked out. And here you are. Here I am. So, and now we talked about this. Uh, so when I was going through, let's say midway through my thing that we don't need to talk about. Yeah. Um, I was going to go to that school. Then I started like digging deeper. I was like, motherfucker, all I do is write essays. And now school is awesome. It's fully, legit. Fully like, accredited. Like 
Awesome school. You, Great. You get a legit degree. Yes. But I want only hands on, which, right. As you know, I, I'm not trying to like fluff my own ego well, here. I'm pretty talented yeah, at things. That's why I had no problem leaving that hand guard with you today. Because I knew, like, dude, I was like, he got this. So at the shop, like, you get pissy during things. And it happened today uh, with the uh, 12 round 365 mags, right? Mm-hmm. It happened today. You took it apart. You got pissy. Not pissy. I'm sorry. You no. I get frustrated. Oh, okay. Yeah. Frustrated. And I dealt with like three other people, and I walked over and I said, "It's this." Click. Yep. We have an odd dynamic. Uh, I, I'm not saying either one of us knows more or less. Okay, you do know more. You know Glocks. I fucking. You know long range. You know rifles. I know long range. I'm probably better with my fingers. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> ladies. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, you're mm-hmm. right. Yeah, we we have that between the two of us. We can pretty much fucking figure, figure anything out. Yeah, like even if we don't know between the two of us, it's yeah. gonna happen. Right. So and yes, I. It would have taken me like. I have to deal. I don't ha- like. I have to. You have to walk off, away. Like, yeah. Twelve customers. Yeah. Watch a YouTube video. Yeah. And like. Because I never did it before. Right. And those 12 rounders I had already done. And right. I literally just went click, click, yeah. click. You you did it before. You knew. and Like, there's not a lot between the two of us. We have not fucked. Right. With. Now, uh, CNR shit? No, no. No. YouTube. Right. Lots of internet research. I And it's not even YouTube. It's just, like, if you give me an exploded diagram, I'll get it. Right. Um, Absolutely. I, I just have that mechanical mindset, and so do you, but sometimes... I get frustrated pretty fucking easy. Uh, you do. Yeah. I uh, do not have the patience to be a gunsmith. The last two ALG <laughs> triggers we did in AKs... I walked away from busy. it. And I just went click, click, click. Yeah, I, I walked away from it. Now, that's actually, that's like the one time I'm not a dick to you. Because I just keep my mouth shut. I'm like, motherfucker, <laughs> I've been there. Like. Yeah. I, I've changed I the water pump on a Honda and said, fuck this fucking shit and walked away. <laughs> yeah. Well, actually, I, I can do them quite easily. I, I can't think of a good example, but it happens. Right. Uh, when I was working on my Benz, changing the fucking carry. Uh, no, it actually was the water pump on my Benz. It was the clutch fan. I walked the fuck away for two days. You have to sometimes, man. Like Had to. Yeah. Look, when I sit like this, it looks like I have your belly. Uh, anyway, oh man yeah we we work well together we really do and you know i think the higher ups know that yeah god i want to tell that story about what? the stamps but i shouldn't <laughs> god damn it uh, mm. so if it comes in we're telling that story next week yeah okay fair uh what do you think we're at Hour and 40. Should we? Yeah, I think we're good. Peace out. What's up? Peace out. What's up? God damn it. All right, we... guys. Thanks for listening to us again. We appreciate y'all. Um, or we fucking hate you. You don't know. Like, share, Point subscribe, that all that good shit. Subscribe star. Subscribe star. If you hung out this long, not motherfucker. A, not another gun cast. Subscribe star. $4.99. It's not four ninety nine an episode. It's four ninety nine a month, and it's That's... not four ninety nine dollars. No, well, that doesn't matter. But it's it's chump change. Unless you're all right, like, we're we're not being greedy. We just want to break even, right? Fair? Right, right. This all costs us money. Like everything costs us money. Uh, but um, yeah, we're not trying to be like we we take people to the range for free. And we fucking throw hundreds of rounds at them. We literally, yeah. And yeah. we love it. We yeah. love it. Especially new people. Yeah. So, whatever. Actually, Subscribe to our, locals. if you want to. Yeah. If not, fine. Don't listen to us. No, no, dick. Don't listen to us for free. Dude, how many podcasts do you listen to without subscribing to their Patreon? All of them. All Except but one. one. Okay. Love you guys. Thanks for listening again. So, you know, you do all that shit and we had a clickety clackety. Clickety clackety.
We'll just start with bye YouTube. Bye. We love not getting booted from you. <laughs> Yet. <laughs> Yet. <laughs>